So hi traders, very good morning. So welcome to live streaming webinar. So first we need to check important liquidity location. Before that, we need to check this global market. If you see this global market, uh, US market is on positive side, slightly positive side and Asian, uh, this is a European market. US market is on slightly positive side and European market is on negative side and Asian market is on mixed conditions. Overall uh, market is on mixed conditions. Now let's check with this on uh, higher time frame. If you see this is a weekly chart, right? If you see this price action price com coming from this levels and after that is some rejection is happening, right? And exactly price rejection from this level. So that is called that time is a double top. So after breakout, some moments. And again, price same re retrace this level. So 39, 200 levels. And I, again, price reaches to all time high. This is a near to all time high. Now it's a double top pattern. If any chances price closes below this level, so then we can expect into price retest this 42,000 levels. Or if any chances breaking this level, we can expecting some movement for this upside. Let's check it on daily time frame. And coming to this daily time frame, here also multiple times get the rejection, right? So next support would be around this level only. Now let's check with this on uh, intraday levels. So coming to this intraday levels, first we need to check with this CPR range. Starting from this uh, 44017 to 440. Uh, 76. So it's a close to 60 pants of the range. So 60 pants of the range we can consider as a medium CPR. Right? Now price is trying to open in between the CPR. Right? And this is the R1 levels and this is the previous day high levels. And this is our trade zone and this is our trade zone and this is our trade zone. Okay? So based on this, uh, we are going to add the four strike prices. So uh, above this level, we are looking for this long. So that case is 44,000 CE and PE add to your terminal. Next is a 43,800 CE and 44,300 PE add to your terminal. So these are the four strike prices we are looking now. Right? So try to add your terminal to these four strike prices. Okay? So uh, our trade plan is very simple. If any chances sustain above this level, we are looking for the long and retracement and we are looking for the long first target would be this levels and second target would be this levels, right? So that cases we are going to take this 43,800 fall option. So because of this uh, 44,080, that's close to 280 points of the range. So we can take this uh, 43,800, right? And if any chances this breakout, we are looking for this 44,000 fall option. Or once this break this level, so we are looking for this 44,300 put option. Or if any chances uh, breaking this levels, so we are looking for this 44,000 put option. So that's what we are adding for this four strike prices. So getting some rejection from this. Let's check with this on Nifty also. So Nifty also, this is a strong uh, wide and widget CPR. So Friday's price is not at sustain above this APR level, so we can consider as a uh, virgin CPR. Let's check with this on uh, central pivot range of uh, 1881, 18, 18 six months is a wide CPR. So almost is uh, 37 points of the CPR, we can consider as a wide CPR. If any chances breaking these levels, but distance is very small, so problem is that. So we can't go for the shot until unless price closes below these levels. So what are the conditions we need to check? First, we need to check with this. Direction of the market. Second, we need to check with the strategy. Third, we need to check with the sets. Fourth, we need to check with this candle confirmation. And fifth, we need to check with this tandem. Sets, then tandem, then candle confirmation. So these are the five conditions we need to check. Once match these five conditions, we are going to take the trade decisions. So right now price is trading below this CPR level. So we can watch for this 44,300 put option. So these are 44,300 put option. One moment traders. Yeah. So right now we are watching for this 44,300 put option. So what are the strike prices we are added? We are added for this 44,000 call option and put option and 43,800 call option and 44,300 put option, right? 
So once price closes below this level, so it direction will be match. Direction, clear direction for this downside, right? And let's check with this in uh, Nifty also. So Nifty also is uh, trying to uh, stable around this level because of this uh, white CPR. White CPR is not going to break uh, easily. So if it is break cases, so definitely we are looking for this only short opportunities. So let's see. So let's see what is going to happen around these levels. And uh, before that, uh, try to add these four uh, strike prices because uh, we can't go for the short immediately. Problem is that for example, if it is price closes uh, around this level, see, if you go for the short, target is very near. See, if it is CPR breakout, then next target would be around this previous day low levels, right? So, better to wait the price action. So, in these cases, we are looking for the retracement opportunity. For example, this type of candle, right? So, that case is, we are watching for this uh, 44,300 put option. And once price coming for this levels, we are going to activate and target would be this levels because of stop loss is very small stop loss, right? Target is big target. So minimum two hour. If it is match the minimum two hour, then only we are going to take the trade decisions. So hopefully uh, this candle uh, looks like indecision candle because of this uh, very big big uh, upside and going to be great big big for this downside. But anyway, we are going to take the tradition only on liquidity locations. So already mark this important liquidity location. This is the trade zone. This is a trade zone. And this is a trade zone. And here also is the same. Uh, is unable to uh, break this uh, central pivot range. But if it is breakout, also distance is very small. We can't go for the short. Distance is not matching. So problem is that. So another one minute time is there. And we need to mark this important level. Why this price is sustaining in this range? Because of this 44,000 psychological levels. So every 500 and 1,000 pounds important for this. Bank Nifty and Nifty, every 100 pounds is very important. We need to check with these psychological levels. Because of this psychological levels, some support is so, yeah, so this is some psychological levels. Let's check with this open interest data. Uh, let's check with this on uh, Nifty. One moment. So, if you see this open interest data, 18700 is strong rejection. This is a 578 trading at around 600 levels, right? These levels. But here still, this people are is a, a little aggressive compared to this. But there is no support at all. So this is very dangerous sign. So expecting some big moments. When we see this type of pattern, so expecting some big moments. But up to 18400, these people are removing their position. So still, these people are expecting for this going long. But here is some. Uh, put sellers are removing their positions. So that means expecting to market is on downside. So let's check with this on uh, bank nifty. So coming to this bank nifty. So 44,000 because of this some psychological levels, right? So very strong rejection. At the same time, some support is there. If it is break these levels, there is no support at all. See this? But here some rejection is there. Some call sellers are uh, available here. But here is there is no put sellers. So that means there is no support for this downside. So that's what, that's what, what we are expecting. See on weekly time frame also, I'm clearly explained this. See, uh, this is a rejection, right? So rejection, falling, retracement. And after that, again, price came for the re uh, rejection. So this is a double top in this time, right? So breakout prices went up to this levels and exactly takes support from this level. So always we need to respect this location. Locations are very important. And then now price is, this is uh, all time high. Now price is trying to sustain above this all time high. It's not uh, able to sustain because of double top. So sellers are activated. Let's check on a daily time frame. See this? So long consolidation. So, is very difficult to breaking these levels. In these cases, two things will happen. 
only 44 500 then only we are looking for the long or once break this 43 736 then we can expect into price coming for this 41 800 so 43 736 is a uh, important now and we need to mark this first 5 minutes candle low and high levels we say this this is a high so why we are marking because of most of the times price it may act as a support and rejection from this first five minutes candle high and low levels. So we are marked this first five minutes candle high and low levels. Then we can add moving average also. Because of this is a parabolic moment, right? So one CPR breakout. What is our target? See, if you are enter here, target is the air. But where you are stop loss, at least some above this level is a safer side. So this is a risk and this is a reward. So that's what we are not going for this short, right? Now we are looking for the retracement opportunity with the confirmation candle. We are looking for the, uh, we are going to take the trade decision with the 44,300 put option around this level only. Trade zones, that's what. We need to respect this trade zones. Or once break this levels, S1 levels, we are looking for this short opportunity. So in between, we are expecting only some sideways market. And traders, in between, if you are having any doubts, please let me know. I will try to explain. Right? So, this is a clearly PPT pattern. Right? And target would be this previous day low. It's completed. Target is completed. Let's check with this on Nifty. So, Nifty is a CPR breakout. Sorry, this is also a PPT pattern. See this? First five minutes candle. This is a pivot pan. Uh, rejection pattern. So target would be this previous day low. So near to target. Why is this not touching? Why is this not touching? And because of the problem with this bank nifty. Bank nifty touch and bouncing from this level. Because of this bank nifty, nifty also is bouncing. So that's what we need to check with the tandem. This tandem is very important. So we need to always Check with this Nifty Bank Nifty chart before taking the trade. Because of this, this just like twins, most of the times follow the same directions. So that's what we need to take the consolidation for this both indices. For entry routes, we are going to take with this direction. So now what is the direction? Is a downside direction up to this level, sir. And strategy is a PPT strategy. Sets. Sets is not matching. That's what we are not paying for the short. Sets is not matching. So tandem is okay. And candle confirmation, candle also is okay. But why we are not went for the short? Because of sets is the problem. Got it, traders? This is a trade zone. Why am I I'm keeping this trade zone? Because of once price come for this level. See this bounce. So that's what. So that's what we need to respect the locations these locations are very important but still this is not breakout so we can't consider as a short of course based on this pattern up to this level we can looking for the only short opportunities up to cpr top cpr levels we are looking for this only short opportunities but we need to match with the sets so sets is matching then we can try if the sets is not matching we are not going to take the trade decision. In this range, we are expecting only some sideways market in this range. So, trend will be established only see, up to this level. See, uh, this levels means, uh, this breakout means it's very near for this R1. So, it's not a good idea. So, trend will be established only this level, this level's previous day high R1, S1 breakout, then only trend will be established. So, these are the two levels are very important. So we can expect in some big moments only above previous day high or below S1. So then only we can expecting some big moments into the market. In between, we are going to do some small scalping in the range with a confirmation candle. 44, 300, we are going to buy in this range. Sometimes it may went up to this levels and it's failure. So that time we can try it. Here also we can try it because of what is this uh, blue line? Is a psychological levels 44,000. 44,000 psychological levels. 
So we can do the scal scalping, but where you will keep the stop loss? Above pivot point would be the better, right? Where is the target? Target is very near. So it's matching only one hour, right? So that's what we are not looking for this short opportunities. Price always respecting for this liquidity locations. Why price is rejection from this levels is a 44,000 psychological levels, right? So once price come for this liquidity location, bouncing happens. Once price coming for this some psychological levels, some rejection is happens. So that's what price action is going to watch. So, so far is clear or if you're having any doubts. We need to mark this so first five minutes candle high and low levels. And we can add, we are using for this eight and 20 EMA for this trend following system. Okay. So that's what, so once analyze the things, then only we can control the emotion in this market. Of course, we are going to get only uh, limited opportunities. That limited opportunity also, we are going to get this high probable trades. So, better to wait for this price coming to our locations. So, don't run behind the price. Wait for this price coming to our location, then we can try it. So, don't get FOMO. Fear of missing out. Don't get FOMO. So market is there uh, till 3.30. Okay. So once get any opportunities with the sets is matching, then we can try it. If it is not matching, just understand the candlestick patterns. What is going to happen? Very big candle. It's very difficult to break. So that means there is no long opportunities. Very simple. And we are looking for the retracement. So where you will get the retracement? Around these levels. So that's what we need to Analyze the things. So once read the candles, so you can easy to predict the market. Anyway, we are expecting market is in sideways mode. So try to avoid. Okay. So we are looking for this locations. Once price coming for this location with the confirmation candle, we can try it. This location with the confirmation candle. Or if any small scalping opportunities, uh, 30 points of the stop loss, 60 points of the target, we can try it. And before that, we need to check this 44,300. What is the intrinsic value, right? 44,300, uh, right? This is a 44,300. Okay, this is a 44,300. Let's check with this an intrinsic value. Now, spot is uh, trading at 44,000 and 388. 44,000 spot price, right? And 44,300 trading at 380. Okay. So this is a premium. So this is a premium, right? So in this cases, uh, 44,000 to 44,300, what is the Intrinsic value is a 300 pounds. 300 pounds is the intrinsic value. Now, what is the total premium is a 380. So the difference, how much is the difference? 80 pounds of the difference. So this is the time value. This is the intrinsic value. IV, intrinsic value. This is the time value. So 80 pounds of the time value is there in 44,300 put option. This is up to valid up to Thursday. Today is Monday, another four days is there. So another four days, we are going to lose 80 points of the time value in this options. So got it traders? How to check with this uh, time value? If you are not understand, please let me know. I will try to explain once again.
You got it. Yes. Okay. So price is coming for this our location near to our location. Wait for some confirmation traders because our distance is very small distance. So problem is that we say this in uh, options. Is a four thirty is a high. Now three sixty five, sixty two seventy pounds is there. But anyway, wait for this some confirmation. Then we can try it. So without confirmation, we are not going to take the trade decisions. So we need to get some confirmation candle, then we can try it. Because of uh, price is trying to sustain above this 44,000 levels. So until unless sellers are giving the signals, then only we can follow with the trend. So you want to explain once again, spot price and premiums? 4450, 365. 44,050 is a spot, right? 44,365, right? 300, 44,300, 365. Distance is 250, right? So how much? Close to 85 pounds. Because of volatility, oh, maybe five, five pounds difference uh, will come. So 80 to 85 points. Because of these movements, no volatility. In this volatility, we can expecting, yeah, 80 to 85 points. Because of it's not stopping, right? It's not stopping. If it is stopping, then we can calculate. Uh, exactly calculation will come. Some five points uh, more or less is going to happen. See, our analysis, what is our analysis? This level, right? But we are not taken because of uh, we are expecting some, but some reaction is there. One surprise. These are the levels. What we are marking the level, some actions are going to happen, some reactions because of sellers are trying to adding their positions and trying to take the control. So there are three entries I'm going to explain. So first is the confirmation entry. Second is the retracement. Third is the ambush. I'm going to explain about this uh, entry rules, okay? First is the confirmation. So confirmation entry is very simple. So this is a pivot uh, pattern, right? So pivot point pattern, right? This is a confirmation. That means is market is going down, right? This is a confirmation entry. So confirmation entry, if you are not get this uh, sets, sets is not matching. So we are going to short only based on this. But why we are not going to uh, short? Because of distance is very small. So this is called confirmation entry. So once price closes below these levels, if it is uh, previous day, low around this level. So definitely we are looking for the short opportunities, but very near. So this is called confirmation, right? Second is the retracement. Now we are looking for the retracement opportunities. Retracement entry means price coming for this some uh, expecting levels, trade zones with a confirmation candle, very single candle. So this is called retracement entry. We, we can travel up to these levels. And third one is ambush entry. So price is, uh, we know that market is going down. And we know that price is going to rejection from this levels. So once price coming for this level, we are going to enter the trade. We can keep the stop loss just above this levels. Once get the one hour or two hour, we can exit the trade. So that is called ambush entry. So ambush entry is a quick scalping. So once price came for this level, some rejection is came, right? So we are enter here, you can exit around this level. So this is called ambush entry. It's a quick scalping. So a lot of skills is required for this ambush entry. 
So got it about these three uh, entry rules? Anyway, market is going down, no doubt. Until unless break the previous day high, so then only we can looking for this long or else we are expecting either sideways in this range, either sideways. So hopefully this is a seller's market only. Not going to uh, establish, right? It's going to seller's market only. So only uh, option bias market below these levels or above these levels. So in this range, we are expecting only some seller's market. Just eating the premiums. So, so far, what is our analysis is each and every line marking and I'm explaining each and everything. So, is it right or if you get any confusing around these levels? So, forget about these entries. Entries will come. Right? This is ambush entry only. This is ambush entry only. If it is confirmed also, problem with this risk reward. Engulfing means this candle uh, has to uh, engulfing, right? So, distance is very small. We can't go for the short, right? So, most of the times, so close to 80% of the times, uh, my analysis is going to perfect. Okay? But I am not right always, right? So, ultimately, we are the humans. We just follow with the trend. And most of the times, we follow with the trend following only. So, we are not going to take the trend uh, against the trend, right? But most of the times, our analysis is right. Because of, I am going to explain each and every candle based on this liquidity location, based on this uh, some psychological levels, based on this trade zones. So that's what. See, first uh, uh, four years, I'm uh, watching the same charts, same CPR. So that's what I'm going to uh, tell you. So what is that our levels and uh, what is going to happen? So based on this uh, candlestick patterns. Am I right, traders? Already marked these levels, right? This is our uh, entry levels. But we are looking for this retracement opportunities. We are looking for this only retracement opportunities. Retracement, with, retracement means we need to get some confirmation candle. But ambush entry means uh, uh, once price reaches to this level, so you can enter, you can keep stop loss uh, above this level, so under target, once get the two hour, you can exit. But ambush is not going to work. The problem with the ambush entry is back-to-back uh, -back stop loss get triggered. So that's what I'm not suggesting for this ambush entry. And a lot of skills is required for this. Now price is trying to sustain below this 44,000 psychological levels. So we can expect some further down. But anyway, we are going to activate only on these levels. So in this range, we are expecting only sub sideways. So don't... Uh, Get FOMO, only some sideways market. Now, important about this engulfing, I'm going to discuss, right? See this, this is an engulfing, uh, engulfing pattern, right? So in these cases, very difficult to engulf once again. If any chances, engulfing means some bulls are having the control. This red line, right? This red candle. Or... It may come for this 50% of the retracement and it may it can follow. Or it may come for this multiple candles. And price is trying to control. So these are the three things will happen once get this angle candles on liquidity locations. This is a liquidity location, right? With the engulfing. So this is very rare conditions immediately engulfing, right? And 50% of the retracement or it may come. Or a small range of candles, it may engulf it. But anyway, expecting only some sideways market. So, just understand the candlestick pattern. Just read the candles. So, you came to know. Read the candles means, candles means is just buyers and sellers, right? The red is the sellers and the green is the buyers, right? So, based on the buyers and sellers, who will win the, the game? So, you can analyze. But don't take the trade decision. So follow the rules. So once match our condition, then we can try it. If it is not match our condition, so don't worry. Just understand the market. 
and read the candlestick patterns. So at this uh, four strike prices, these are the four strike prices add to your terminal. And here also see this pivot point rejection is a doji candle, so again is engulfing. So trying to be angle. So another two minutes time is there. Once time is there, so some actions are going to happen. Let's see. Time also is going to, uh, we need to watch time also. The five minutes uh, time. So faster movements means some actions are going to happen. Still is the two minutes is there. Some actions are going to happen. But anyway, we are not going to take the trade decision. Just watch the market around these levels. Yeah, of course, uh, now, if it is price come for this level, we are not looking for the short. In these cases, price uh, uh, break this all the stop losses and closes in this range with the confirmation candle, then we can try it. Because of, if any chances price coming for this levels, no, so definitely it hit, uh, hit the, all the stop losses. Price went up to this levels and again closes below this level. Then that time we can try it. And here also retracement also we can enter, but problem with this uh, stop loss is the issue. Target is very small target. So one hour is matching. At least two hour, but we can't keep the stop loss just above these levels. Some buffer stop loss around these levels. The problem with this two hour is not matching. That means uh, if you see this in options, you enter around this 370, 380 levels, right? 380, where you will keep the stop loss, stop loss is 340. So 40 pants, target is 80 pants. 80 means is a 460, right? 460 is the target, right? So entry 380, stop loss 340, 40 pants of the stop loss, right? This distance is 40 pants. So 80 pants of the target. Does it go into worse? High made as a 430, right? What is a high made? High means target, right? This target price is coming for this level. It made a 330. But what is our target? 360. So 360 means this is our target. But once know this important liquidity location, once price come for this level is going to bounce. So we are not going to take the trade decision because of sets is not matching. 40 points of the stop loss means at least we need to get 80 points of the target. But this is an important levels. If it is not there, definitely we are looking for the take the trade decision. 40 points of the risk we are going to take. But here is trade zones important levels, liquidity location, previous day low. It may act as a strong support because of it's already price comfort this level, bouncing is happening. That means buyers are waiting for these locations, right? So once price reaches with this level, so buyers are going to either book the profit, sellers are book the profit, or buyers are going to adding their positions. So that's what risk reward is not matching. That's what we are not going to take the trade decision. What it traders? So traders, I'm, uh, I'm muting. Uh, so if you're having any doubts, please let me know. So anyway, this market is on sideways mode. Uh, let's uh, marking our levels. This one, we can write. And this is a, we can write. This levels, or this level we can write. So these are the three levels. So these are the three levels we are going to activate. This is only short, not long. This only short with the angle candle, but long only above these levels. So up to this level, there is no long opportunity because of this is a rejection, right? 
This is a seller's idea. So most of the people there keep the stop losses around these levels. If it is closest above this level also, distance is very small. So try to avoid. And long also, this is a retracement opportunity. Because of this is R1, R2, and we clip out these levels. So here to here, so 44, 220, 44, 330, right? Only 100 points of the uh, distance is there. But here is the 60 points of the distance. So better to wait for this breakout retracement, we can enter the trade because of uh, risk reward is a problem. So this is a retracement opportunity, right? And this is also failure and closes in between, we can try it. This is a failure. That means it's hunting stop losses and closes in below this level. We can try it and we can travel up to these levels. So this is one opportunity, right? Or this breakout uh, S1 levels, I just remove this. This two trade plans is understanding or if you're having any doubt. Yes, okay. So this is a retracement opportunity. Breakout, retracement, we are looking for the long, right? And this is also short opportunity. It's failure. And again, price uh, closes below this pivot point with a confirmation bearish angle. We can try it, okay? And third, S1 breakout, and then we can try it for this S2 levels. But try to avoid parabolic breakouts. What is a parabolic breakout? For example, this candle is there. This one big breakout. So that case is wait, failure, and closes below this level, then we can try it. We can enter around these levels. So these are the three trade plans for this today. What are traders? Or if you're having any doubt, please let me know. And coming to the strike prices. Yeah. Uh, above this level, so this is a 220, right? So this levels, we are going to take uh, 800 means 400 points. 400 is, uh, okay. You can take 43,800. 43,800 call option around these levels, okay? So forget about this 44,000 put option, right? 43,800, sorry, 44,000 call option, okay? 43,800, you can take this trade, okay, and retracement. And in this level, 44,300 put option. And in this levels, 874. So you can take 44,300 only. So 44,300 would be the better for these two locations. This is also 44,300, right? One moment, uh, I'm going to, uh, so 44,000 call option is not required. And put option also is not required. So just to take these two strike prices, okay, and take the trade decisions. 43,800, 44,300 put option. 43,800 call option, 44,300 put option. These are the two strike prices is enough right now, okay? So just follow uh, our trade plans. So expecting some sideways market, okay? I just remove this, all these things. Shall I remove all these things? All trade plans? If you're understanding, I will remove, or else once again, I'm uh, repeating, okay? I will do one thing. Once again, I'm repeating. Okay. But anyway, market is on sideways mode. Okay. So I will wait for the another 10 minutes and at 10 o'clock, I, uh, I close the session. Okay. So just follow these three trade plans. If any uh, chances to uh, price is uh, matching our uh, trade plan, then we can try it. Because of in this range, we are expecting only some sideways market. Right. Okay. Uh, so did you got this trade plans or if you're having any doubt, please let me know. I will try to explain once again. Because the market is on sideways only. So there is no uh, trend established market today. So only once breaking this levels or breaking this level, then only trend will be established. So in between, we are expecting only sideways market. In this sideways market, we are looking for this only short opportunities. There is no long opportunities. Sometimes it may hit and again, it closes below this level. Then we can try it.
Exactly, exactly. The fake out is going to happen. That means it's, uh, it's most common uh, habit for this uh, bank nifty, hunting the stop loss patterns. Just hunting and hit and run. Just hit the stop losses and run. This most common uh, pattern for this bank nifty, most of the times, okay? So these are the three trade plans. Once again, I'm uh, repeating these three trade plans because of, uh, so the market is on sideways mode. So there's no, uh, we are not going to get this opportunity. So that's what uh, I'm uh, trying to close the session around this 10 o'clock. Okay. Yeah. So if any chances price uh, closes above this previous day high. Okay. So wait for the, some retracement opportunities. We can travel up to this R2 levels. So this is a trade plan one. And coming to this trade plan, if any chances price come for these levels, fake out and closes below this uh, pivot point. This um, in between is a pivot point levels with the confirmation bearish angle candle. This confirmation candle is very important traders. Bearish angle candle. Why this bearish angle candle? We can enter these levels. We can keep the stop loss above this candle high. That's what bearish angle candle is going to help to us. Right? And target would be this previous day low levels. So this is a trade plan two. And coming to this trade plan three. Uh, if any parabolic breakout, try to avoid Okay, or once match the risk reward, this is the S2 levels. Risk reward is matching. We can write for this uh, trade plan three with the uh, 44,300 put option. Here also 44,300 and here also 44,300 put option. And we can travel up to this S2 levels. Uh, but parabolic breakout candle cases, wait for some retracement and fake out and closes below this level, then we can write. Okay. So try to follow this uh, three trade plan for this uh, 11 to uh, 10 to 1 o'clock. So we'll uh, reassemble around this 1 o'clock. And if you get any opportunities, uh, uh, you can take the trade based on this, our conditions. Once match this uh, conditions. Anyway, this uh, we are looking for this short only. This two trade plans is a short. That means it's a direction. Direction is matching. There's no problem, right? And strategy also is matching and sets is a problem. So once match the sets, then you can take the trade decisions. And remember traders, if it is 50% of the achievement also, our account will be on positive side. Only 50% of the achievement, but you need to follow with these rules. Let's expand. See, for example, if you take this monthly 30 trades in a month, right? Let's assume that 1000 rupees of the risk and 2000 rupees of the reward. So 15 trades are losing trades. That means 15,000 rupees of the loss and 15 trades are winning trades. So that means 30,000 rupees of the profit. So overall 15,000 rupees of the profit. Like this, only risk reward can help to us. Our account will be grown. So got it traders? Always follow the rules. Always follow the sets. Sets means is a stop loss, entry, target, position size. Anyway, 50K capital challenge, we are going to take this uh, only one lot up to one lakh. Take only one lot. If you have the two lakhs capital, take two lots. And five lakhs capital, you can take the five lots. Follow the rules. So always follow with the same lots. So, so far is clear traders. And if you're having any doubts, please let me know. I will try to explain. So once again, let's check with this uh, open interest data. This is very important. Now these people are adding their position. See this? So 44,000 levels. So people are adding their position. So that means expecting some bounce around these levels. But anyway, see, uh, first we are going to enter the trade based on our five conditions. So direction, strategies, sets, candle confirmation, tandem. This is an add an advantage. See, now we are looking for this only short, right? If it is, call sellers are more. So there is an add an advantage. And secondly, buyers and sellers. If it is sellers more, so there is also add an advantage. So we can't take the trade decision based on the sellers, based on the open interest. We are going to take the trade only our conditions, based on our condition, five conditions. 
But if it is sellers more, here is 1 lakh and here is 140, that is add an advantage and boost up our trade. So we'll be get more confident. And remember, Terrell, once enter the trade, uh, just leave it to the market, either going to hit the stop loss or going to hit the target. So in between, do not involve any emotions. 50% is going to achievable. 50% of the achievement is easy to achieve, right? Based on our uh, price action trading strategies. Am I right, traders? 50% very easy, easy to achieve. But we follow the rules. Rules are very important. Follow the rules. Of course, sometimes it may come. Winning, winning, winning trades will come. Sometimes it may come continuously losing trades also. Losing, 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 losing. And after that, winning will come. But we stick on that. We stick on the strategies. So once you get this, four stop losses hit and you may uh, fear to take the fifth trade. So don't do that like that. If you enter the trade, either going to hit the stop loss. For example, you enter around this 380, right? You can get the stop loss 340. You are entered, right? Just leave it to the market. Either market is going to hit our two things will happen, right? Going to hit you hit the target or going to hit the stop loss. So do not involve any emotions in between. Once enter, just leave it. Market is going to take your stop loss or going to give the profit. Very simple. What it is? And if you want to write this level, so you can write it down or you can mark the levels. So do you have these levels? CPR, R1, previous day low, S1 levels? Yes, okay. Okay, so you just follow this uh, uh, three trade plans. Okay, so traders, I'm going to signing up. We'll catch you at one o'clock. Is it okay for you? Just follow the rules. But anyway, market is on sideways mode, right? Market is on sideways mode. Okay. Yeah. So, okay. Thank you very much, traders. We'll catch you at 1 o'clock. So, I will send the link. Thank you very much. And follow the rules. And once enter the trade, leave it to the market. Either going to hit the. Because of you enter the trade means... Risk reward matching, then only you can enter the trade. For example, you are entering the trading here, right? Very good risk reward is matching. Just leave it. Either going to hit the uh, stop loss or going to hit the target. But do not involve any uh, emotions in between. Of course, losing trades will come. This is a part of trading. Losing will come. Don't bother about this. Just follow the rules. Okay? So thank you very much. We'll catch you at 1 o'clock.